He's a motivational speaker and a corporate entertainer. He's performed worldwide from the Sydney Opera House. He's performed in Paris. The co-author of Best of the Best and the author of Boring Meetings Suck. It is my pleasure to introduce to you John Petz. Mr. John Petz. John Petz. <laughs> I'm a speaker and professional magician. I've had some great opportunities of performing all around the world, but I have never broken into the television business. But on Monday, I actually just signed a one-year contract with HBO. So I'm excited. Oh, thank you. I get all three channels for $4.95 a month. <laughs> because after 85 years of being in business, if we don't learn to think a little bit differently, and learn to be innovative in who we are and what we do on a daily basis and remind ourselves of why we do what we do, we're gonna fall back. Mission-driven mentoring is about creating leaders. And it's based on the Air Force Doctrine Document 1-1. And just as the video program noted, it is not for any particular rank. It is for all of us to learn from and provide two. You prepare, you execute, you follow up. That's the name of the game. And you can tell the folks are inspired. They get passionate about what they do. They're having fun with what they do, but they're working their best at the same time. And sometimes it's tough when you get focused on something, you miss the bigger picture. And I realized that, you know, it's not just signing up new partner stores. It's about building the T-Mobile brand, about when that customer walks in the door, they see how easy it is. That staff at that outlet, that store, that super center, whatever it might be, is trained on your phones and are prepared to answer the questions of your customers. That's looking at the bigger picture. Yeah, watch, watch, watch. Do you see it go? Okay, it's right over here. Don't pay attention to this. That's going to throw you off. I want you to watch my hands. Watch my hands. All right. Left hand or right hand, Terry? Right our secret, our, our secret. Come on, that's our deal. You got to see the bigger picture, folks. You got to see the bigger picture. You walk up to the counter, and I'm kind of looking around, and this woman looks, she says, how can I help you out? I had my briefcase, and I stood there, and I said, well, I hear you've got the best coffee in town. And she came right back at me and said, you heard right, what can I get you? And I'm just kind of looking around and she could tell I was totally out of my element. So she comes around the counter, she has a spoon and she starts taking a little spoonfuls of coffee beans and she's letting me smell each different type of coffee. And then I come to this beautiful Italian section, all this ready-made foods and I'm just looking in the glass case. And there's a person that come up and I said, how can I help you out? So I'm just looking, first time here. It's your first time here? Well, let me tell you about our store. Never in my life have I gone into a retail establishment and every single person that I met in that store, hourly associates, had genuine passion and pride in what they were representing. And how often do you see that in our country? Don't say your name. Have we met before? No. Okay, perfect. Just like we practiced. <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can come up with what she's gonna say here. All right. California female, never met her. For the first time, nice and loud, in the microphone. I'm committed. What is your name? Susan. Susan, that is correct. Good job! <laughs> Well done, Susan. And I'll tell you, whenever you're going to be in the spotlight, you may never know when that could happen. You may never. But you always need to be prepared. If you've got that pride, if you've got that passion, then it's your moment for showtime. I have to ask, how long have you been doing magic? Um, counting right now. 15 years, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Perfect, let's try something here. You stand right there. Now, uh, if you've done magic before, you must have a good ta-da pose, right? Ta-da. You gotta step forward. It's a big ta-da. 
Because when you do it, the audience goes crazy. Are you ready? Right. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready. Count to three, ready? One, two, three, 